Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Star Flames. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe, turn on your notification bell and join the family. In this video guys, we're gonna talk about the, you know, fallacies that has been going around about Bianca Sensori and her hubby yay because now it is being reported that the couple they're taking a break from their marriage this is about the 99th time they're taking a break as per the media <laughs> they're always making up stuff about this couple if you look on all media outlets right now the only person they're talking about is yay and bianca sensori and this by itself tells you that there is an agenda. The agenda is to cushion Diddy, is to shield him as much as they can. A lot is coming out about Jay-Z, Beyonce as well, but those people, remember that even Ye told us that Jay-Z and Beyonce is controlled by Hollywood. Everything that Ye said last year when people said that he is medications needs to be adjusted and he needs to be in institutionalized. Do you guys remember how people were saying this man needs to be in institutionalized? But irrespective of the fact that they have been pushing and promoting Ye to be crazy, he has never told a lie. Nothing he said has been proven to be a lie. As a matter of fact, everything is coming to light now. And when you look at Ye's interview and Cat Williams' interview, just imagine, why is it that whenever someone speaks out about Hollywood, the first thing the media does is to promote that person as crazy? And then the people, you know, that believes in these lies, they start to go off on Cat Williams, they start to go off on, yay, these men are crazy, they need help. And when crazy is right in front of their eyes in black and white, they don't want to get that person help. Because when you look at the amount of people that are homeless, really addicted to drugs and just need someone to really help them, no one wants to help those people. But like hell, why does everyone want to help you and Cat Williams knowing that they don't need help? But let's talk about this nonsense report that is coming out because you know what is happening 2024 is the year of reckoning they can always throw Ye under the bus they can always throw Bianca under the bus at the end of the day right nothing that they're saying is factual make no mistakes I'm not saying that it is impossible for Ye and Bianca to get a divorce if they divorce, it is on their terms, not on the media or the court of public opinion. It doesn't matter how you and I really love Ye. If Ye and Bianca decides to call it quits, it is for their own personal reasons and nothing like what the media is throwing out there. But let's talk about this report because you know what? It's really nasty of the media to be including Mr. Leo Sensori. Bianca's dad, that man, you can tell that he doesn't speak. When we'll see Bianca's sister, her mom in LA, not her dad, because that man knows who he is. And it says though the media is secretly trying to trigger this man for this man to come out and do something. Cause he's not gonna, he's, he's not gonna lash out on anyone. And Bianca's aunt and sister has told us one thing already. The family loves and supports Ye. The media just misinterprets who Ye and Bianca is. Not only that, Leo is a very calculated man. He's not going to speak to anyone about his daughter. And he's not going to trash his daughter to anyone. That man is nothing like that. But let's get into the reports, as I've said, right? Because they're saying that Ye and Bianca are reportedly taking a break from their marriage. This development comes after Sensori's friends, again, the friends, we know who that friend is. It's Kim. <laughs> it is Kim <laughs> with a false narrative in the media as though her, you know, you see every time, this is what I say. You can know who is Hollywood puppets. Kim, Cardi B, Jay-Z, Beyonce, Diddy. Who am I missing? You know, but I mean, 2024, is going to ruffle some feathers, honey. So you better be genuine. You better be authentic more than ever this 2024. Else, if not, it's going to expose your ass. Your backside is going to be out there to the wind, honey. 
<laughs> but let's continue, right? Now, they're saying that, you know, the, the, this development comes after Sensori's friends and family express concerns about her husband being controlling. Like, haven't we read all the allegations about A? Like, why are they keep coming with these things? Like, you know, people are going to believe them, but no one who really has a functioning brain is going to believe the media, really. I'm going to keep it real. If your brain is functioning, even at 50%, 45%. I remember this girl that I um went to high school with. Her brain was fun functioning at 35% capacity, and she was always a straight A student. So if that girl from my high school brain was uh, functioning at 35% at capacity and she was a straight A student, you have no excuse to be buying into the bullshit that the media is pushing, okay? Because why, like, when you look, just to give you guys a hint of what is going on, we have Hola reporting on EA, Mail Online, Daily Mail, the UBJ on MSN, Yahoo, TMZ, um, and the list. We have, you know, New York Post, Washington, everyone, everyone. And when you look, who's talking about Diddy? Nobody ain't talking about Diddy. No one is talking about the things that are being reported. No one is stressing, emphasizing, you know, we have, um, L magazine, we have um Pink Villa, we have Daily Express, we have El Paso Times, we have the Mirror, we have the Metro, we have hosted on Emerson, we have the Sun. Everyone, everyone is talking about Ye and Bianca, and this is how you know that Hollywood co Hollywood cover up, honey, it is hella real, okay? Once you are a puppet, they're going to do whatever they can within their powers to shield you. But if you're not their puppet, if you're not playing by their names, they're going to paint you to be the bad guy. You know, did we see any media reporting on did like this before his takedown? Heck no, but they will always come for gay. But let's continue, right? Because they're saying that um Leo Sensori has been vocal and that man doesn't speak to people about nothing. That man is what you called, what do we call them? Okay. We know that this man is coming from a mafia family, right? A mafia family. He's not going to talk. He's not going to be vocal. He's going to be acting, you know, if that man wanted to do something, it would have been done. But let's continue. They're saying that he has been vocal about his disapproval of the relationship, even though labeling Bianca and Kanye West trashy naked trophy drew to her revealing outfit. However, there are supporters who believe that there was no actual breakup and that Bianca sim simply went back to her hometown. Bianca ain't back in her hometown. She's still in the, I, I think they're still in Italy. They're, she's not back in her hometown. Every minute they just recycle this old garbage off the news and spit it out there, you know, like their fast food restaurants. They serve you garbage. <laughs> Man, if you all can't see what is going on, I don't know what else to do. But even see, we wonder can see the play that is at hand. Now guys, Honestly, I'm not going to get further into this nonsense BS, okay, honey? Let me know <laughs> what is your laugh today about the media because we ain't buying this, honey. We ain't buying it, not even for a second. We're too smart. We're way too smart for this BS. But I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what are your thoughts. And while you're, while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care. And see you guys. Later. Peace.